Welcome back to Adam Smasher, a technological Minecraft mod pack where I have been saying that we need to do all the... Oh, I'm, I am in the wrong bit of the quest line. These technologies for two episodes now. Unfortunately, we got sidetracked by the wonders of the nether and bits of cybernetics, but let's get on with it. I want to build the centrifuge. Let's come on in here and have a look. The centrifuge, of course, is for my ore processing plant. There's t only two more things to put on the ore processing. If we cut, how, is, how did we get back there? How did we get back there? Uh, the centrifuge is here, and then over this way we have the industrial blast furnace. These are the two things I definitely want to make today and possibly get onto the metallurgy confuser that we already actually have one of, but that's all right. That's fine. That's no problem. Uh, to make the centrifuge is a many step process. As you can see here, we've got to make motors. Uh, we need to make uh, advanced resource machines. Uh, we also need to make a mining laser. Now, the mining laser is a weird thing. Let's come on in to here. We need to make some of these crafting alloys that I'm sure you guys will remember made from uh, these alloy ingots, which is actually a bunch of plates all placed together. Uh, advanced circuits, just up on the wall over there. But also this stuff, this redstone and crushed diamond. So if we get a whole bunch of that out, and then I believe we just kind of slap it back in there. Was that not right? Did we have to process this some other way? Let's have a look. Use up the, have a look in the uses. Okay, we need to actually compress it. That's fine. That's, that's, no problem for me. Over this way, we've got a compressor. We made this for um, compressing air into our uh, iron blast furnace here. Why is this not ticking over? Uh, because the power's not connected. Okay, well, whilst we're here, let's let's finish this off, shall we? Just need a tiny little about, amount of air more. The heat is the thing that is waiting there. But here we go, energy crystal. Ba -dee -ba -am. If you guys are like, what's this thing? Well, it's an energy storage device. Can I put it in there? I can't put it in there. That's a little bit unfortunate. So one of the things I need to do is upgrade my, uh, my bat box technology here. Um, there's a bat box. There's a... MFSU, there's there's a whole bunch of ones, but I want to I want to get the uh, the CERN. I can't I can't remember what it's called, but it's it's something like that. It begins with a C uh, to get that charged. But it doesn't matter whether we charge that or not. We still get a mining laser. Bam! Now this thing, obviously, you charge it up the same way. You shoot things as if they were uh, shoot blocks like a like a laser gun, and it mines for you. Which you know I can kind of understand why that goes in the centrifuge. Uh, over this way, we've got this other box that we're trying to create. So if we come in here and have a look at the resource advance machine, uh, what we're actually missing here are some carbon plates, uh, steel plates, crafting alloys, and. Uh, iron box we have seen before but these are crafting plates these carbon plates it's all about the graphene powder if we come over here and grab a whole bunch of these now the reason these are uh, the, the way we make these sorry let's say that again uh coal dust in the manufactory and what do you know coal uh, coal dust is just coal in the manufactory wherever it is okay so that's nice and simple to uh, get to uh from here we wanted to perform just a couple more steps no that's the recipe not the uses got to try and remember it's this one here we are going for okay let's try and make a few of those ah it's not going to tell us is it that's that's not that's not incredibly useful if i'm to be honest with you let's just go through the recipe line and grab a whole bunch of those uh i'm not gonna have enough am i okay let's let's get some more was it two carbon meshes is two carbon meshes gonna be enough yeah we just then put these in the compressor again it's a uh, useful having a compressor laying around it's got to be said got to be said all right let's pop that in there i was just gonna throw that in there for now uh this should be the last of the iron being processed that way what have we got in my box not a, not a great deal of stuff i don't know what to do with the titanium it just keeps turning up uh, I, I don't know i don't know uh this is the one that i'm after man it's gonna take a while all right, a while has been taken. Let's go back over to our little crafting area here and make this weird, like, box, advanced machine frame, you know. Uh, so, mach What? How? What? How did, did you, oh, how did that happen? What? I, I don't know. Things, they come along, they, they confuse me. Okay, the next thing I need to do is make a whole bunch of these coils. We've made these before. I can't remember what for. I, uh, the blast furnace, I think, we needed to make it for, actually, now that I take a moment to stop and think. But we also want to make one of these electric motors. All right, so we are, like, seconds away from getting all the stuff together. I just need to uh, remember to grab a few bits of iron, and then we can come over to this workbench here. Should we do it in this workbench here? I think so. Click, click, click. Got ourselves a centrifuge. Oh, yeah. Now, as far as I'm aware... Now, I've not... Re I've, I've, 
I'll be honest. I've not looked up to these things. But this is how it normally works for me. Uh, yeah, so we feed in the contents of... Let's have a look. Where's the recipes? So we, we feed in these cure... Uh, crushed and purified products to get some extra stuff out the end so in the in the box here can, can you show me we need to put it in between the furnaces so we move the furnaces down put them in this place all right let's do that big bam get inside all right let's try and see what's going on here right we definitely want to clear off these guys how do i how do i do this i have i didn't bring any scaffolding with me so we're gonna have to just do this by the seat of mine pants uh like that okay that's pretty good unfortunately we just broke my wrench and i kind of needed that okay let, let's go make another one ah disruptions Okay, let's try this again. We're still going to need that box because we're still going to end up having, uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? The concrete powder and the other stuff, like the small piles of such and such, you know, whatever it is we're processing. Uh, is it not going to let me put that there like that? That's... Um, that's not where I wanted it. No, don't do not do that. Don't do that. All right, I'm going to try and find some scaffolding, I think. Did I bring any in here? Uh, uranium ore? I mean, this this kind of looks like scaffolding to me. What what could go wrong there? Did not like me doing that? Okay, fine. Uh, let's go up here. Come on. Build, build the tower. Build the tower. You can do it. All right, something like that. Let's try putting this one here here uh same idea that the the chest over there is actually after the centrifuge though no doubt i'm gonna have to configure correctly uh and then i suppose we're gonna have to feed some stuff it oh wait 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 next what one more stop one more stop along the way uh let's try like this you're not gonna break you're not gonna break okay uh i'm sure we can do this somehow let's just break that by hand put an electric furnace down there the connection is strong does it say that it's going to uh, pull on the bottom it does say that it's going to pull on the bottom that's pretty good want to then put this as a an in yep and then want to take the other bit as an out i don't have a pickaxe in my hand this is a major oversight cool i do actually have one man i thought i was thought i was gonna be in a little bit of trouble there i thought i wasn't gonna have a pickaxe and then i'd have to be like oh another break time guys all right let's put this out to that one but the one thing i am missing is how to get the power down there i think i think we can do it this way if i break this use my fist on this one here we'll go that we'll move this whole thing down one level and that should be fine this hud overlay is just a little bit much sometimes right there's that feeding in over this way no like like this yeah i mean your redstone sensitivity should be on anyway uh okay is it all looking good is it all looking good? I think it's time to go and feed something through. I'm not sure what we've got that we want to feed through, but I think it is time. Uh, I think today I'll be feeding in a half stack of copper. There's no way this can go wrong. Now, it doesn't quite simulate me coming back from a mining mission because I've only put one type of stuff in there, and I know that's probably going to break it. But, uh, sorry, extra items are probably going to break it. But let's have a look. Let's see what's going in there. Right, we're getting macerated. That's pretty good. I like that. The next question is, where are all the items going? They're going over this way, right? Okay, so we're going to the, the crushed copper. Is that really where it goes? I would have thought it would have gone in there. I wonder what these two are about. Is there a press for butter for um, recipes somewhere? There we go. Do any of them have an input there? Okay, that's not the case. Hmm, interesting interesting i presume it's some sort of like water input or something like that i don't know i don't know uh so that was that i then want to have a look down at the centrifuge if i can uh around this way so there we go we are centrifuging nice 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 uh i don't think we're gonna have the outputs that we want let's uh let's let's wait and see i'm not sure if anything's gonna come out here that i'm not ready for so here comes an output Yes? No? Yes? Are we, are we cooking? No? I saw I saw something build up to top top level there. Let's have a look. I'm not sure. Oh, 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 things are going. I've got some small tin out of it and things like that. This box is definitely going to have to move. Small tin. Okay, so we're going to have to get some sort of like compactor or canner or packer or something like that. There'll be a, bot a machine that puts little bits of 
like tin and stuff like that away. Does this have to be removed before? Oh no, there, there we go. It's going up. Okay, so it's somehow I'm gonna have to deal with stuff. Where where is all the copper going? It is going in there, and we are dropping it out the bottom. Okay, so so that's cool. I just need to think about how the chests get arranged there. But let's leave that for now. I could definitely think about it, but let's leave it for now. We're going to uh, check on the next quest. Oh, in fact, wait, 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 wait. We finished the quest. Let's have a look at what we want. I don't know, an IC2 teleporter? I'm, I'm not sure. Titanium iridium alloy plate? I'm actually going to leave it. Oh, no, that's the blast furnace anyway. <laughs> uh, I might go... Oh, oh, you know I was saying how I wanted one of those. Claim. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so what we're going to do, actually, I thought we were going to jump straight to the next quest. No, no, no. We're going to go replace a thing. This thing over here, right? Is this on wrench mode? There is a wrench mode there. Can I right click? I can't. Where? Where is my actual wrench? It, uh, the Industrial Craft 2 seems to be very poorly configured to work for other, um, other mods. I'm not sure what the actual problem is, but it just doesn't seem to want to work. All right, these all charging up now. Uh, I don't know how to tell. Something's charging up, but I'm not sure if this is this is doing it right. So we've done the centrifuge. Let's move on to the industrial blast furnace. Mostly straightforward. If we come over to here, you can see that we need to make an advanced machine frame. The only thing that's any different here is how to make these carbon plates. You just make one of these carbon bricks, put it in the pressurizer. It's just a bunch of car charcoal. It's really simple. This is, of course, the advanced alloy, which is this three layer thing yeah we, we, we've done all that before bam we got that now let's move along to this next one and we need to put this in here but this we now need uh just a few more things this cupro nickel heating coil yeah uh, so it's a it's a copper and nickel a mix but you need to put it in a rolling machine what rolling machine well thankfully i've gone ahead and made one over here it's just pistons advanced circuits and compressors all of which we have built before now what do we do with this rolling machine i assume and this is where it always goes wrong in the past. I assume we just hook it up to some power and get rolling. I don't have an exposed power core anymore. This is uh, not the most helpful. If we, if we do something like that, maybe it will work out for us. Okay, so that goes in like that. And I've also grabbed a whole bunch of stuff here. If I click like this, yeah, it's the nickel in the corners. All right, let's do this and see if we are missing anything. Normally we are missing something, but let's have a look. It's 0%, all right, yeah, okay. We're going to have to try and figure how, what, how this works. Um, hmm. Maybe it does. So I just went and had a look on the internet, and I can't find anything about how it needs to like be given a signal or anything like that. But maybe it does. Let's let's just throw that and have a look. See if that gets it rolling. It doesn't. That so there was nothing on any wiki about how it needs any item. Maybe if we power that. No, that's still not going to work. Hmm, this is very confusing. Configuration slots, I mean, this is great, but still not really what I want. I mean, we can output... No, but I'm not, I'm not looking for an output. I'm just looking for this to work. <clears throat> totally not using lead instead of nickel. <clears throat> so to fix this, I need to process a bunch of iron through the industrial grinder back there, and that should just produce us a bunch of nickel. Nice. Okay, small technical issues aside, this should now get rolling. Okay, we are actually into some percentage numbers working for us here. I need to let this run for twice, two times, because unfortunately it'll only give me three. Now, three sounds like a great number to be outputting, but I actually need four, which is going to leave me two left over. And I'm not sure what I'm going to use them for. I'm sure that, in fact, should we, should we have a look? Let's go R. Uh, no, not R. U is the number I'm looking for. Uh, the, literally the only use. The singular use. I, I, I might even have to recycle these. All right, let's go over this way. Uh, was it this one? It was indeed in here. Biggity bam. I believe we've got another quest done. All right. Now, I could go and insert this into the uh, the setup over there. Yeah, I thought it would need a multi-block. Oh, wow. It needs more multi-block. That's all right. That's fine. We will get on with that at some point but today today i'm all about the quest so let's try and is 
It's not, not going to work for me. Ah, all right. What, what, what do I have to pick this up with? Do not want to risk breaking it. Making myself a new wrench. No, is that not the way this one? Shift click. There we go. Okay, so with those done, let's move on to another quest. Yes, indeed. Actually, what, what do we have access to here? Loot chest, titanium, iridium, plate, teleporters. I'm probably going to go for the loot chest, but let's have a look. Wow, it has opened up here. Fusion reactor, RF tools, turret defenses. Let's get on with the method metallurgic infuser and wrap up today's episode before we look on to the next stuff though metallurgic infuser i believe there are two different ways of making this bad boy indeed one much harder than the other we're gonna we're gonna make this one down below the osmium ingot might be a little bit difficult but i think over this side i should have one. Oh yeah beautiful all right i'm gonna go around and have a look and see what i've got here okay metallurgic infuser relatively simple osmium redstone enriched alloys and advanced circuits all things that I have just laying around as it turns out and biggity bam what do you know there's two of them I'm just gonna throw that in there with the rest of the stuff that I've already done but I think with that I am gonna say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure ladies and gentlemen I will see you guys next time we're gonna get on with a few more of these quests you can see a whole lot has opened up here uh, fusion reactor says it's done what the mm, the ultimate power production well there we go I, who knew who knew we'll be moving on to turret defenses playing about with rf tools other dimensions and stuff like that but i will see you then when we're gonna do that bye